Welcome to this week's edition of the Falcon Report. This week is October 17th through October 21st. Let's check in on Playworks for the game of the week. Hi, Sprucewood Falcons. We don't have a game of the week this week because we've got a short week with the fall break, but we would love to introduce to you our junior coaches. Jaden, at your service. Savannah, Zoe, Aubrey, Aspen, Simone, Maddie, Ty, Ari, Cicely, Laney, Mihai, Grayson, Ali, Cole, Tyler, Aaron, Blair, Blake, Trevor, Rory, William, Catherine. Now back to our report for this week's story highlights. Hi, my name is Maddie and I'm with Easton who has a joke for us. What do you call an alligator in a vest? Hmm, I don't know. What? Investigator. <laughs> Thank you. I'll have to tell my cousin that. He loves alligators. Here are our high flyers for Servness. In kindergarten, we have Tristan, Marla, and Luna. In first grade, we have Shaylin and Avery. In second grade, we have Daphne and Brandon. In third grade, we have Piper D and Piper C and Jacob. In fourth grade, we have Paisley, Violet, Jared, and Samantha. In fifth grade, we have Catherine and Olive. Way to go, high flyers. trip to Jordan Landfill. Can you tell us something you learned? I learned that the average person throws about four pounds of trash away every day. I learned that they buried their garbage underground. I learned that they bury garbage on a slope so it's easy to bury. I learned one more thing and that is they have three layers underneath all the garbage. Two layers are like doggy pads, they absorb all the water that and liquids that we throw away. And then the other layer is to protect all the solids from harming that layer. Why is it important that they put something like doggy pads under all the trash? Because otherwise it could go in the cracks of the pipes and it could harm our water. That's very bad. What did you learn about recycling? I learned that the most common thing to be thrown away can be recycled. What's that? Paper. I learned that recycled stuff can be reused. I learned that one soda can can be turned into four hours of energy that we could use on our TV or our phone. That's really cool. It sounds like you learned a lot on your field trip. Thank you. We currently have 28,808 care cards. Our goal is 30,000. Keep up the good work, Falcons. Hello, I'm back with Miss Kristoff, a new teacher in first grade. Where are you from? I'm originally from Mount Pleasant, Michigan, but I moved here from Washington State. Ooh, that's cool. How long have you been teaching? This is my 14th year in the classroom. 
I've done a few years in pre-K, a few years in kindergarten, a few years in second grade, and then the last two years I was in fourth grade before moving down to first grade. Fourth grade was my favorite year. <laughs> Do you have any pets? I have two dogs. I have a 11-ish year old dog named Timothy, and I have a three-year-old dog that still acts like a puppy named Thule. Say, my dog sucks like a puppy. <laughs> what is your favorite movie or TV show? Um, my favorite TV show is um, Gilmore Girls or The Office, and I like any movie as long as it's funny. Cool. I like funny movies too. Thank you, Miss Kristoff, and welcome to Sprucewood. Thank you. Here's what's happening at Sprucewood this week. Thursday's work Thursday's schedule will be done. There's no school Thursday or Friday for fall break. Have a great week, Falcons. Watching the Falcon Report! Report.